reminder. Okay. This is the brakes and this is the footrest. When you ride down intermediate hills, you're going to be using your brakes a lot and you're basically going to start riding on them. Also, uh, when you're going down the intermediate ones, you have to learn how to lean the bike uh, left and right more. Okay. So let's start, let's start you off with uh, simple stops using your feet and then we'll move on to using our brakes. Now, we're going to practice stopping our bike by using your feet. Now what you want to do is practicing how to stop it with your feet and turning the bike at the same time. Basically, we did we stop ourselves just more, but this time we'll also use the bar to turn the bike. Ready? Or lean the bike and turn it the other way. how to ride our brakes okay the brakes will not stop you on an intermediate hill but it will slow you down to make a complete stop you have to turn the bike and go uphill so right now let's try riding our brakes stand up on it you can feel how the brakes slow you down Uh, as you're riding on your brakes, you can push your right foot more or your left foot more basically to make the bike lean. However, when you do that, the rear skis tend to start sliding out from under you more. When that starts happening, you want to turn your uh, front ski towards the bottom of the hill and uh, side slide. After okay, you regain your, you're feeling comfortable, you can lean the bike back in the other direction and similarly point the front ski going down the hill. Okay, I will illustrate that in a minute.
we're going to combine the side sliding and turning. So this way, when you turn and you side slide, once you have regained control and you're feeling comfortable with your speed, you want to lean the bike in the, different, in the other direction and uh, go ahead and turn and side slide until you're feeling comfortable. Then once again, go ahead, lean the bike, turn and go in the other direction. I will demonstrate it for you. last lesson, what we're going to do is we're going to combine side sliding and going down the hill. The idea is not to let your rear skis slide out too far from under you and what you're going to end up doing is kind of a fishtail or carving with your rear skis.